United States Supreme Court, the Honorable Ketanji Brown Jackson. Celebrating history today in the White House Rose Garden with the confirmation of Judge Ketanji Brown Jackson to the U.S. Supreme Court. It has taken 232 years and 115 prior appointments for a black woman to be selected to serve on the Supreme Court of the United States. But we've made it. Of the past 115 justices, only five have been women, just three people of color. For President Biden, this moment fulfills a campaign promise. It's a powerful thing when people can see themselves in others. Judge Jackson will be sworn in after Justice Stephen Breyer retires this summer. She clerked for Justice Breyer, graduated from Harvard Law School, and once served as a public defender. Today, giving a shout out to her high school, Miami Palmetto Senior High School, where proud students watched and cheered. To know that she was in the exact same place as I am and she made it up there gives me hope for my future. Judge Jackson stepping into the role of role model reflected in her own daughters and her own history. In my family, it took just one generation to go from segregation to the Supreme Court of the United States. Promising to approach critical cases from religious liberty to voter discrimination. Without fear or favor. A soon-to-be Supreme Court justice vowing to uphold this country's rule of law as she advances its history. In Washington, Alice Barr, NBC News.